All right, folks, where well, we're going to showcase something today that you probably have never seen before. Even if you're a, a, a budding watch collector, this is a piece you'll want to hear about. There's a company, Parmigiani Florier. They have introduced a Tonda PF GMT Rotropont. So this particular piece is part of their line called the Tonda PF. Uh, it's a 40 millimeter watch, but it's also a GMT with a Rotropont, meaning that you can split the hour hands uh, and then catch them back up together for you world travelers. Typically when you see a Rotropont, it's because the seconds hand of a chronograph are able to split up where you can time two items at one time, whether it be dog racing, horse racing, car racing. In most cases, that's what Rotropont in correlation to is those seconds hands. So this is the first time I've actually seen a company that are giving you a Rotropont with the hour hand where you can synchronize the two to be able to do dual time. In most cases, what happens with a uh, dual time zone is that you would either rotate a bezel or you might just unscrew a crown and pull that crown out so you could separate those two hands. This is so simple. You've got one button that splits the two hands and then one button that synchronizes the two hands. You'll notice that the dial on the watch actually has a texture called guiloche and Parmigiani actually calls that barleycorn uh, guiloche. So uh, a unique name for a unique texture. What I think is special about the dial is I love the color of it. It's not an in your face kind of blue. Parmigiani calls it the Milano blue, which is almost kind of a midnight blue. And I love the texture of it. You'll notice that on the GMT hand, it's actually 18 karat rose gold versus the hour and minute hand being an 18 karat white gold. The hands on the watch are just straightforward hands with an open work look to them. So you can actually see through the hands themselves. But when the two hour hands are actually synced up with each other, it totally looks like it's just one hand. Not only does this watch tell you time here at home, but it'll give you a second time zone if you decide that you want to travel. For instance, there is a button at 8 o'clock that you can push to advance the local time. Let's say you're traveling to New York, you would want to push that button once because New York is one hour ahead of us. So the white gold hand, which is the local time, will show you the time in New York. And then the rose gold hand, which is the time at home, will show you the time here in Minnesota. And then let's say the day after tomorrow, you decide you're coming back to Minnesota, you're gonna push the button at the crown, which is also, by the way, an 18 karat rose gold pusher inside of the crown that synchronizes those two hour hands back up and makes them one again. I wanna mention the actual bezel on the watch, which I think is pretty fascinating. It's a coin edge bezel that Parmigiani decided to do in platinum which really adds to the luxury part of this watch. It can be worn as a sport watch, it can be worn as a dress watch, and it still looks fabulous. But it's a 40 millimeter case, which has been said to be the sweet spot on anybody's wrist, whether you have a small wrist, medium wrist, large wrist, 40 millimeters with a slimline case, it's gonna look great on you, it's gonna feel great on you. This piece also has a sapphire crystal with a sapphire crystal back, so you can actually see the movement of the watch once you take it off your wrist. This particular movement is the PF051. Parmigiani does everything in-house, including their movements, but they use different parts of the movement to give you a little bit more eye appeal, if you will. Probably the first thing you'll see is that they use what's called a micro rotor, which helps with the winding of the watch. And that micro rotor is actually in 22 karat gold. So if you use a higher carotage of gold, the weight is actually heavier, so it swings a little easier, keeping the watch wound while you wear it on your wrist. But think about all that goes into the hand finishing on every bridge, on every part of the movement. You've got two or three different type of grainings that they call them on the movement. One would be Cote de Genève, the other would be Perlage, with 207 parts, 31 jewels, 48 hours of power reserve. This is an amazing engine that runs this watch here. One of my favorite parts of this watch is the bracelet of the watch. Not only does it fit well on your wrist, but there's a lot of comfort 
in this bracelet. Parmigiani does something called teardrop lugs on the case that help with the comfort of the bracelet. It's an integrated bracelet, so it fits right into the casing seamlessly and then very comfortable on the wrist. I think when you're talking simplicity and you're talking elegance, to be able to do a watch of this standard with this type of complication with no date, just that simple gesture of not having a date lends to the elegance of something like this. A Rotropont is one of your four grand complications. Uh, so to have something this complicated that's done in such a simple way uh, is just masterful. If you have any questions about the watch itself or some of the pieces that we have in stock, uh, please feel free to reach out and subscribe to our channel if you'd like to see more cool watches.